I'm back again for another review. So this is something that we purchased for our house. Um, we were looking to um, renovate, no, not renovate, like upgrade our cabinet since it's old. So I've seen this one from Amazon. Um, it was made by the Decadom. I don't know if I if I um say that right, but um, it is the let me see. The 36 by 30 inch medicine cabinet so we sized it um, side by side so that's where our problem starts there's nothing wrong with the um, the sizing they said it right it's just we put a tiles next to it so it took us a while to be able to figure out what's what we're gonna do with it so if you are a handyman you can do it yourself you don't have to hire anybody um it's an easy install and if you get into trouble of fitting anything um you know like um that doesn't say on the instruction or you just couldn't figure out yourself um you can call the owner he's friendly um he's patient um, I think that's a good thing because he said he did it himself. So we were actually able to speak to the owner to um, walk us through it. So yeah, that's the only problem that we get into is the wall when we put um, tiles next to it when it says 36 and our space is actually 36. So make sure that if your wall to wall is like the same size as the mirror, you might want to um, get a smaller one. So it's too late for us because the only thing that I didn't like when we said that we're, we're going to return it because we made a mistake is that he said we packed it really well, actually. We put it back where it was. Uh, where My husband and I are good in unpacking and packing things, but the owner obviously doesn't want it shipped back and he says that something like it might get broken along the way and he's not gonna refund us the full amount we have to pay for the shipping fee and if it's damaged so we don't want to take that risk because we know we packed it the way we unpacked it but if it gets there and then you know along the way get damaged and then we don't get our money back so we just work on it and then um figure it out so um okay so this mirror is actually not cheap it's i don't remember but i think it's like 1000 plus between 1000 and 1500 dollars um is it worth it mm, with the price probably not now that i see how it is in person because i'm a little bit clumsy so i just hope that i don't um i don't mess it up so let's go now to what are the features of this expensive cabinet because um maybe it's worth it for you but not worth it for me because sometimes i'm cheap so anyway uh it says the installation type is recess so that means see here it's just you know you just put it like to the wall and you don't have to like um dig at the back um, it has a defogger, which is this one. So if you take a shower and then you know how your mirror gets foggy, you just press this. It turns, uh, before you take a shower, you press that one. So when it's red, that means it's starting to do what it's supposed to do. So you take a shower and then, um, you'll see it. So I'm going to start, um, the, the, oh no, maybe not because you're not going to hear me. Anyway, so. It doesn't defog the whole mirror. It's only defog like a square where your face can fit in. So don't expect too much that it's going to do the whole thing. My husband said that it's going to take so much electricity. Maybe that's why they did like just a small one where you can fit your face. Um, there's electric outlet inside. Ooh, fancy me. Okay. So it comes with an electric outlet. So why do they put that there? Okay, so... We liked it. One of the reasons is because they have that there. So you can actually adjust this. It's, you know, you can move this, this thing. Um, 
the the height that you want that one is to plug your usb or anything that can fit in there so we have our electric toothbrushes so that will save us plugging here and have all the wirings you know on the here so um that one is one reason why we like it and then when you opened the the whole cabinet there's a mirror behind it so if you're let's say um you want to see yourself doing something and you have something over here that works too and this one has a built-in um let's see i'm reading the picture so this has a built-in where you can face, like magnified. So that's good. You, you save space on putting extra everywhere here because everything is inside. So one thing is um, if you don't know anything electrical, maybe you need to hire somebody because you need to connect everything together. But uh, since my, ha my husband is an um, electrical engineer, so he has a little background on how to do this. So we didn't have a problem with that. He did it by himself. I help him sometimes, but you know, husband and wife <laughs> work together doesn't really work together. <laughs> so he just did it himself. So I say he's good on those kind of stuff. Okay, so um, you have one, two, and three that you can move based on what height you want. And then, of course, there's a mirror here. There's a mirror on the side. If you love mirrors, you get what you paid for. So um, there's one thing also that I feel bad that we cannot use is the side here. Both sides also have like this thick of a mirror. So these are all around mirror, except from the back, of course. Um, this clock, uh, also save us a nightlight together with this one. So, see? Okay, so you press this one. It turns blue. Let me see if I can show it to you. So, that's that. And then you press it one more time. It gets a little lighter, like um, off-white. And then you, one more time, that's going to be like yellowish. So, if you just want it not too bright, then you have an option to... Um, use that so there's like one two and three and then one more time it's gonna turn off so that one we don't really need this light here but you know it doesn't give enough light if you just you know depend on this one that's why we um, decided like we're gonna put another light there so this is from a different company but I thought it's gonna be cute with all those little um beads there so i'm gonna turn it on see it's, it's bright enough and my husband put a little dimmer on it see isn't that fun yeah okay then ta -da. so that's that uh what else should i say uh -huh. the mirror type is a bevel flood um like I mentioned, it has a defogger, electric outlets. There's a lightning inside, and both on the um, both sides. Um, mirror shape is rectangular. The length is thirty six. The width is five, and the height is thirty. Um, okay. It has a anodized anti-corrosion aluminum there's a defogging heated glass that's what i was talking about earlier silver mirror copper free led task light the warm neutral and cool color the one i showed you on the side um there's an on and off button so you can choose which one um <sighs> It's a soft open and close soft too. The interior light is a LED. The cosmetic mirror 
it has three times the zoom it's also led the thick of the glass thickness of the glass shelves is eight millimeter it has a shelf clips concealed and adjustable it has a bloom soft closed me mechanism this has uh, it has bloom hinge 170 degree open swing um it has a dual outlet 20 amp and a dual usb 2.0 so we're gonna open this one more time so that's that Uh, like I mentioned, it's an easy install, but you need probably need two person. My husband did it by himself. He did the ele uh, the electrical wiring and all that. Um, it has a two years warranty. Maybe I don't know for what, but maybe for the lighting, because you know, um, that's probably it. So it comes with a hardware kit, so you don't need extra thing to use. They provided everything um i think that's it it has a manual that you can use and um based on the function i'd say more than a thousand dollars between i don't remember if it's a one three or one four that we paid for but i think right now it's out of stock on amazon we got it from amazon by the decadom um the owner is friendly He'll help you. Um, is it worth it? Maybe we purchase it because of the functions more than the look of it. Um, it has the clock that we need in the bathroom. And who says, oh, needs clock in the bathroom? Well, we do need a clock in the bathroom, especially women. Because we take so much time fixing our faces. So, obviously, I didn't fix myself today because I'm not the one I'm reviewing. It's the mirror um yeah it has a clock it has the lights on the side it has the defogger it has a built-in three times the zoom for your eyebrows um it has shelving that you can adjust based on the height that you need um you can hide all the wirings of whatever you're charging um if you want to charge your phone hide it here if you have kids <laughs> that would work because you can just basically charge your phone here and put it here or wherever. So that's much about my review. I hope that helps. If not, well, at least I hope you get entertained by what I have in my house. So that's it for now. Um, I'll find something else to review. And I hope to see you later. Bye-bye.